What is going on YouTube? Lamont on the run. Today, we are in Coetta, Oklahoma. Or is it Coetta? Uh, I'm not really sure. I probably should have checked before I started the video. Well, it was too late. I gotta stop now and look it up. But anyways, today I want to talk about a grave. A particular grave that I have visited before, but I did not do a video about. And there's a reason why I did not do this video and I'm gonna tell you. So we're gonna talk about the grave of King Vaughn. Uh, if you guys don't know who King Vaughn is, uh, he was a rapper based out of the South side of Chicago. Uh, he is known for having a, I guess you could say he's known for committing some murders on the streets that uh, he takes credit for through his music or he took credit for through his music. And uh, he is attributed to at least possibly either being the trigger man or being a part of at least a half a dozen murders. Uh, this guy is well respected in the gang community in Chicago. Even his uh, enemies uh, respect this guy. Uh, they have said that this guy really was about that life and that, uh, in so many words, uh, he was knucking futs. And, of course, King Vaughn was killed on November 6th of 2020 down in Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, the trigger man in that was, um, I think his name is Timothy Leakes or Timothy Meeks. Uh, he goes by the rap name of Lil Tim. Uh, his case has yet to go through uh, the uh, jury trial and all that. Anyways. So King Von's killed and he's buried in Chicago. So I happened to be in the area in Chicago uh, when I uh, noticed that somebody had posted a video of King Von's gravesite. And I watched the video for about five or six minutes and I, I asked my friend Scarlett, I said, hey, I said, uh, like, I'm about 125 miles away. I want to go see if that's really the gravesite or not. Uh, so she watched the video and she noticed a landmark in the video that basically told you if you're in the area, you know exactly where the cemetery uh, was. So it was very, very easy for me to find. So I drove a couple hours over there. I went to the grave uh, site and it's a, it's a grave site that I've been to excuse me, cemetery that I've been to at least three times previous. And I seen his grave. And the first thing that came to my mind was I was shocked at that, you know, because it wasn't like he was a millionaire per se, but he was well on his way to becoming a millionaire. And I was shocked at the location of where they would put him. Because you think somebody that uh, well known and that famous would have been put in at least a mausoleum because in Chicago, uh, gangsters over there uh, have a very nasty habit of disrespecting uh, their enemy's graves. Uh, for instance, they'll have videos or pictures where they're either pissing on it or uh, pouring stuff on it or just basically being very, very disrespectful. And considering that this guy, King Vaughn, had a lot of enemies, you would think that uh, they would have put him in a more guarded cemetery. Now, partly... I was thinking this has to be a fake gravesite. Like this can't be where they really put him. Like maybe this is like a fake one and he's really at a secret location, which is what I would have done if I were a family member of his. But that is his gravesite because I've looked at Instagram videos that people were doing at his funeral where they had a bunch of people there and the ground, well, you can tell that is their gravesite. Again, I don't know why they would put him there. Um, I'm going to guess... I'm going to guess as things like this happen that they're going to move him. I don't think he's going to be there very long. And if I were, you know, Lil Dirk or whoever, I would really, really just move him somewhere more secure. So this uh, rapper, a, a girl rapper based out of Chicago called Avena Bankrolls or Avena Money. I'm not sure exactly what her name is. One of those two names. So she goes to the cemetery and she takes a picture standing on his grave. And she said, and I'm not going to quote her, but she basically said in so many words, if I had a penis, I would piss on this grave. 
Um, I don't know who this girl is. I guessing I'm assuming that she is from an enemy gang or she doesn't like King Vaughn. She doesn't care for him. And uh, this is exactly the reason why I didn't do a video at his gravesite. I'm a very easily recognizable person in public. Uh, I go to Chicago quite a bit. Um, I'm always, I don't want to say I'm always in that area because I'm never really always anywhere, but I do like Oklahoma. I do often come here and I do often go there. And when I seen this picture, the first thought that I came to my mind is, wow, this woman has a death wish because there's going to be a lot of guys out there who want to make a name for themselves by gunning down this woman. And she simply did this for clout. Clout is a dangerous thing. It's kind of like a drug. It's really, really weird. So she currently, for the last two or three weeks, oh, you scared me there, boy. Oh, you want to play? Are you lonely? Are you bored? We're talking about King Von over here. Do you think he can jump over that fence? Uh, we don't want to find out. Wow. You are uh, stealing the thunder out of my video. I'm going to have to I'm going to have to get away from you. Uh, doing good about yourself. He looks excited. <laughs> As it, he, he looks excited. <laughs> so, anyways, moving along. So she is the most uh talked about rapper out of Chicago uh in the last week or so. And I don't know what she's going to get out of uh, in terms of, um, you know, what she did. Like, it, is she going to sell more records? Is she uh, what she hopes to accomplish uh, or what what her uh, end game is at the end of the day? But um, that is exactly the reason why I did not uh, do that video. Uh, I, I did not want to be... Uh, I guess, I guess you could say I did not want to take any kind of heat for me going out there. I didn't want to expose his grave uh, to people doing stupid things like that. Trust and believe, um, a lot of people, and I'm not putting this out there in the universe, but uh, a, a lot of people out there uh, would not, let's just say this, if I were to do a video or somebody, uh, they would not number one like it and number two if they were to see me or whatever person uh it would not be good for that person uh sometimes you just need to leave things alone sometimes you just kind of need to uh let things lie so to speak and you know that guy king von i mean talented rapper but uh he's a crazy guy you know what i mean he's just nutcase <laughs> this guy you could almost say you know and and you know you could almost say this guy was kind of like a serial killer in a, in a weird way. And he, uh, he really lived that life. And like I said earlier in the video, even his enemies, even his enemies said, oh, yeah, yeah, he was crazy. Definitely crazy. Definitely not a guy that you want to run into uh, on any side of Chicago. So I'm going to be following this story for quite some time. I'm curious as to see what's going to happen to this girl. Uh, is she going to get beat up? Uh, I think she will. I think bare minimum she will get beat up. Uh, will something w even worse happen to her? I can see that happening too. That is not something that you want to play around with, guys. That is not something that you want to play around with. Uh, there are certain graves that I just won't cover. His is one of them. And I did want to do a Chicago like you know like the graves of chicago rappers video i wanted to do that a few years ago but uh i'm not it's just not worth it all right guys i am out of here i am uh working my way on down to broken arrow by the way i keep forgetting uh i, I gotta go to the pet store and start carrying bones with me uh just for times like this when i see him just throw him a bone i don't know i love animals but you know not trying to get bit Anyways, guys, uh, leave a comment below. Tell me what you think uh, about the, the story, about the, about the nonsense this woman created for herself, created for her family. 
I don't know if she's mentally ill or what, but uh, leave me a comment below. Tell me what you think. I'm out of here. Peace out.